Very ambitious. <laughs> and very tasty. I'll tell the service not to do that either. Lorelai. Yes. My napkin. Oh, oh, what? Yes. Your napkin, yes, your napkin. I got it. Do you want me to just tuck it in your shirt there? Or? My lap will be fine. Okay. There you go. Feel free to spill anything you want down there. You are covered. the next course? Lobster pot pie. You may bring it out now. Okay. Suki, how far along are you? Eight months. <laughs> Lorelai, there doesn't seem to be any reason for a pregnant woman in her eighth month to be running back and forth to the kitchen, does there? No, there doesn't. You should take my plates, otherwise you have no place to put the pot pie. Oh, I can think of a place. What was that? Plates going bye-bye. Okay. When I give the signal, you run in a distractor, and I'll take her down. Got it? Here we go. Suki's famous lobster pot pie. Very nice crust. Thank you. Well, Suki, I must say your food is as accomplished as I remember it. Oh, thank you, Emily. And I think after we fine-tune the presentation, we'll have ourselves a very nice dinner party. So we got the job. Yes, you got the job. <laughs> we got the job. <laughs> thank you. You will not be disappointed. No, I will not. The event starts at 7.30. I would like you to be here at 4 o'clock. I'm going to make a Xerox copy of my notes here so the two of you can peruse it on the way home. Mm. <laughs> we did it. We got the job. What a score. We landed a whale. Yeah, we always <laughs> had the job, Suki. The whale was just toying with us. She was swatting us with her tail and hosing us down with her blowhole. Because that is the whale's M.O. Humiliate and rip apart every other fish in the sea until there's nothing left but a bloody pile of chum. Well, you really hate whales, don't you? I'm afraid you aren't going to be catering the launch party after all. What? Why? Your father and I just decided to go a different way, that's all. A different way? Now, of course, I realize you've already put out some money. Yeah, we have. Of course, I will reimburse you for all expenses. Just give me the receipts. <sighs> Great. Well, that's it. That's all I came to tell you. OK, well, thanks for the notice. You don't have to take that tone with me, Laura. Really? I don't? After you made us do that ridiculous tasting at the house? You told me to treat you like any other company. Oh, but you sat there like the Queen of England making us jump through hoops and taking pages of ridiculous notes. And for what? So you could fire us? Is this payback for me not telling you about the business? Because I have to say, Mom, even for you, it seems a little extreme. I understand you're upset. Yes, I'm upset. We needed that money, Mom. And I knew that humiliation was part of the package, but I did it because I had to. And just you abruptly firing us is completely wrong. I agree, it is wrong. Well, okay, then. As long as you agree it's wrong, what? okay. I'm sorry, Lorelei. I really am. I thought your table was lovely. I thought the food was wonderful. I was really looking forward to this party. I think it might have been the best one I ever put on. So then what happened? Oh, you know, times change, Lorelei. Things that were once considered proper and elegant are now considered stuffy and out of date. Like what? Like canapes and cocktail parties and the people who plan them. Mom, what are you talking about? Nothing. It's not important. Mom, come on. Jason decided to take the clients to Atlantic City instead. He thinks that's what they would prefer to do. He's probably right. Anyhow, what do I know? Did he know all the work you put into this? It's really not important, Lorelei. I do this for your father. I have done this for your father for the last 36 years. If he thinks that Jason's right, then it's fine with me. And after all, now I don't have to worry about a party. I can just relax and hang out. Mom. Anyhow, I have to go. I'm wasting all my hanging out time sitting here talking about this silly party. Send me those receipts and I'll get you a check. OK, well, great. I Apologize to Suki for me, will you? Sure. We'll see you girls Friday night. <laughs>